Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim and Assalamu alaikum. I hope all of you are doing fine and I am back with another topic that is how many ways. In this lesson we are going to learn in how many ways we can add three to four numbers. That is on learner book page number 14. Now I have this number in front of me 7, 2, 9 and 8. It's a set of numbers. Before starting that, I want to tell you that we have to find the number pairs first. We are going to add these numbers uh, through number pairs to 10. So these are all the number pairs to 10 and I have to find which is the number pair here. So 2 here and then I got 8 here. 2 and 8 you can see gives me 10. So I'm going to write 10 here. Now I'm left with 7 and 9. I'm going to write 9 first because that is a bigger number than 7. And it will be easy if I add that first. But you can add either way. You can add 7 first and then 9. Now I have this. Nine. I will get 10 plus 9 gives me 19 plus 7. Now you can just simply add 7 in 19 by counting on your fingers. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. So my answer is 26. Now this is one way of finding the number. Another thing I can do is I know I got 10 here and then I can make another 10 because 9 is very close, is very near to 10 and I will need only one more to make it 10. So what I can do is, I can take 1 from 7, I'm going to uh, split this number like this, 6 and 1. I'm going to take this 1 and then I'm going to add that in 9. It will make another 10, right? So first I got 10, Oops, sorry, then I will have another 10 because I took it from 7 and then I will be left with 6 you can see here I'm left with 6 here and I gave 1 to 9 and that gave me this 10 and I'm going to write 6 here so 10 plus 10 is 20 and 20 plus 6 simply will give me 26 so these are the two ways I used to add the numbers now let's add some other numbers add up the numbers in each set now this is a set of numbers and i have to find the total or the sum of it so the first thing is i'm going to find a number pair sorry the first number pair is 2 and 8 so i'm going to write 10 here fine and then i'm left with 7 and 6 again and don't forget to put the sign of a sequel to. I will have 10 plus 7, 17 and then 6. Now you can simply, simply count on your fingers. 18, 19, 20, 21 and 22. Let's repeat it again. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22 and 23. So my answer would be 23. This is my one way of finding because this was straightforward I got the number pair but now what I can do I can make a number pair by adding uh, 3 and 7 how will I do that I'm going to split my 6 in 3 3 plus 3 will give me 6 and as I know the other number pair for 7 would be 7 plus 3 that will give me 10 right so I utilized this 3 and I'm now only left with 3 here what I'm going to do again this first number pair to 10 I got 10 then I made the number pair of 7 and 3 because I took 3 from 6 and 3 is left I made that 10 and now 3 is left like this and 10 plus 10 is 20 let's write that 20 plus 3 and that will give me 23 
so again we use two ways of adding the numbers you can uh, use any way you like to add the numbers simple first you have to find the number pairs to 10 and if you can make another number pair by splitting the number like this you can also do that now let's move to another example now I got 7 and 3 now 3 plus 7 or 7 plus 3 that is a number pair to 10 so I'm going to add it like this first of all I'm going to write 10 now I am left with 8 and 4 so what I'm going to do I will write 8 plus 4 10 plus 8 gives me 18 let's write 18 then I'm going to write 4 here now simple count on 19 20 21 and 22 so my answer is 22 now let's uh, find that in another way this 7 and 3 first number pair now I'm going to make 8 what will be the number pair for 8 yes I will need 2 to make the number pair for 10 so what I'm going to do first I will write the first number pair 7 and 3 because that is very clear to me then I'm going to split my 4 because I'm going to write 8 here like this then I'm going to split my 4 2 plus 2 gives me 4 this 2 will be left and then I'm going to use this 2 like this I will write 2 here and 2 remember that 2 plus 2 gives me 4 and I have split the number 4 in two parts now again I got this is the number pair so 10 plus 10 plus 2 now 10 plus 10 is 20 and 20 plus 2 that is simple 22 now these this is very easy and again you can use any method you like now let's move to the next part now to the sh uh, today we are going to learn the shape hexagon hexagon you have to learn the spellings hexa means six or having six remember that in you have to learn it when you learn the meaning of hexa it will be very easy for you to understand it, its properties now starting from this corner to this corner this is side one and this green line is representing the one side now two three four five and six so it has six sides hexagon means six and it has six sides and it has six corners now when two lines join together at a point when two lines join together at a point that is known as corner and this pink line here is representing this corner fine so we have to count the number of corners one two three four five and six so it has six corners i hope you understand this video take care and allah hafiz